so you watched the previous video and if you haven't here's the link in the top right corner and in the description below learn about the five different personalities their strong positive characteristics what makes them tick and thrive at work you also did the questionnaire so you are here to find out more about your shadow side or the one of your colleagues this is the video about this little minifigure mix please people aiming for harmony is one thing focusing unrealistically on it in the expense of everything else is another mix please people thinks that investing all this energy to keep everybody happy is their purpose an impossible mission and wasteful agreeing with everything that is said with wide often manufactured anxious smiling evident nodding just to avoid even the slightest of confrontations to avoid upsetting people defies any purpose of teamwork and yes they may even support ideas suggestions recommendations that they know that are wrong just for them to be accepted to earn their colleagues approval no is a word that doesn't exist in their vocabulary and others are fully aware of this as they dump their work on mix please people's desk during times of change Mix Please People exercises the art of fence-sitting. They try to keep equal distance from all dominant views and share no opinion whatsoever in fear of upsetting somebody. When they pluck up the courage to do so, the lack of assertiveness shines through. Their sentences are often verbose, full of flowery language, full of ambiguity, ending in an interrogative tone, like a question, raising questions, in fact, over their confidence, conviction, even abilities. If you are like Mix Please People, remember, your strengths are with people, so put them in motion. At moments of tension, turbulence, uncertainty, Facilitate conversations. Help fill the cracks, gaps, even chasms in a team under pressure. Your thoughtful, considerate nature will repair relationships and help others see the light at the end of the tunnel by asking powerful questions without rattling any feathers. Your strong intuition is invaluable. Your energetic availability too. So use them both wisely and here's a kind note to yourself not to others to you this time it's okay to consider and respect yourself your catering to people's needs is second to none but remember to put forward what you want to without any hesitation and people will listen you have won them already after all Knowing your drivers, your working styles and how you may react under pressure at times of change may be invaluable. This conscious awareness of the reasons behind these strong emotions, what triggers them, as well as knowing your strong points and your shadow side, gives you more choice to slow down, reflect in the moment and perhaps act differently. Because knowing yourself better is power and as always thank you for watching if you found this video useful hit the like button below share it with your friends and colleagues and subscribe for more that'd be lovely till the next one i'm lazaro wolf take care